let you go because it is on the front of the Times this morning talking about Savile giving advice to the royals. That's being uncovered in this documentary. And we only have to cast our minds back to January. Boris Johnson made that slur to, to Sir Keir Starmer mentioning Jimmy Savile. It's such a toxic association. It caused shockwaves you know, all through Parliament. How will the royals weather this then? Well, I mean, the royals will do what the royals do, which is bury their head and, and make no comment at all. I mean, when we did the second Savile exposure programme, we looked very closely into the connection between Prince Charles and uh, Savile and also other members of family. I mean, Savile used to go into Buckingham Palace and sit down and have cups of tea with the staff there. He was very, very close to Prince Charles and to Lady Diana. And in fact, at one stage, he was courted to be the consul for Prince Charles when Prince Charles was going through problems in his relationship with Princess Diana. I mean, absolutely mad, given that Savile himself had no long-term relationships ever in his past. He, he, and the question that gets raised, and I think has never been addressed, is how did this man, when there were concerns, and we know that because the Metropolitan Police had a significant amount of information in their record, how did this man manage to get to a position where not only was he given an OBE, MBE, he was knighted and he was a papal knight. This is a man who got through all the security checks. He